Hey guys, I'm here to try to illustrate an issue I'm having with the last uh, update for Ford Sync and my iPhone. Um, prior to this update, which I believe from Ford is 4.6, that's the last time they updated, I think it was last year, um, in 2015, uh, this worked. Uh, what I'm about to show you worked. Uh, there was no problems with it, everything worked as it should. Um, now, uh, I can't get Siri to work with the um, with this new version it worked the same day that I the same day that I installed the software before installing Ford sync or Ford my sync whatever the heck they call it this is the non touch screen version this is a, just a regular screen um, I'm in a 2013 Ford Focus SE and it does not have the my touch so it's Ford sync or Ford my sync or whatever they call it um, like I said it, it um, worked minutes before installing the newest software which is not all that new <clears throat> and from Ford and then uh, this no longer works so here's here's my issue um, normally I could press and hold the button and activate Siri all right she comes on um, you can't hear her through the car audio system she can't hear me if you notice this there's no down here that would move when she hears you um, that does not happen okay everything else seems to work fine I can do Sing. Please say a command. that's by pulling the that's by pulling the lever call phone is that correct yes phone please say a command call work Please indicate whose contact information to view by saying phone book and a name. But anyway, it works. But see, this is the reason why I, uh, I'm going to cancel that. This is the reason why I use Siri. Siri does. I didn't understand see, you. Please try again. I, I find. Uh, and you can't cancel it. You just got to let it time out. It's just. There. iPod. Is that correct? No. Phone. Please say a command. Let's go let it go. This is, uh, I find I find the sync thing extremely frustrating. It's not intuitive at all. It doesn't it doesn't hear you well at all. I didn't understand you. Please try again. See, and then we just keep going through this. This is why I hate it. I absolutely hate it. Um, I haven't touched the button again either. It's just it won't give up. Please say a command. Help or cancel. Cancel. Hey, see, this is this drives me crazy. So with Siri, I could do everything I wanted through my phone. I could, you know, pull up a map, play music, whatever. Um, and, and for the most part, it works. Siri works a lot better than this thing does. Now, the weird part is my everything else with Bluetooth through the car works. So let's play music. Now, see, but it won't do this. It won't do it right straight. You have to go like this. Phone, please say a command. Bluetooth audio. Bluetooth audio. Okay, now I can, on the, on the, down here, on the steering wheel, I can move to the next song. Or go back and control my volume that all works I can place calls through sync even though it didn't work just now I can I can do that um, I just can't use Siri for anything it just it just won't work um, see even now that I'm I've used the Bluetooth audio let me just fire Siri up again you'll see she doesn't recognize that I'm speaking now the other thing that happens here is so normally I should be able to dictate through here too. I, again, I could do that before updating to Ford My Sync 4.6 or My Ford Sync. Again, I don't know what it's called. See, no audio. So there's something going on with this update where they disabled the audio input uh, for the iPhone. And I've updated the software on the iPhone. I don't think it's the iPhone. Like I said, this the same version of the iPhone software worked just prior to installing sync 
and that same day it stopped working and I didn't change anything on the iPhone um, so I'm not sure what it could be I, th I think I I've contacted Ford and um, they of course blame it you know I contacted them both by chat and uh, um, phone and I got of course different answers every time uh, one was it's Apple's fault of course um, and when you try to explain to them that it worked you know it worked previously and the only change was the Ford 4.6 uh, they, they don't they don't they still blame it on Apple uh, one guy told me that they disabled the the audio feature because of Siri hands-free and that this version of sync is not compatible with hands-free um, or eyes free I guess it's called Siri eyes free I and and that allows you to activate Siri from the steering wheel I'm not trying to do that I, I'm trying to do what I used to do before which is activate Siri by holding down the home button which has worked for years um, it, it, and it, they broke that functionality I don't I'd like to think it wasn't on purpose but uh, they don't seem real uh, eager to fix it so uh, I'm making this video and I'm hoping other people will have the same issue and we can some sort of raise some sort of uh, flags at uh, Ford so that they can get this fixed so anyway that's that's Ford sync 4.6 and uh, an iPhone I'm running 10.2.1 right now but nothing that, that makes any difference because when I installed it I wasn't I was running I think uh, nine or something like that but um, it, it still doesn't work uh, with subsequent updates from Apple and uh, like I said I don't think it's an Apple issue I think it's a Ford issue um, so let me know down in the comments if you have a similar issue um, let me know if, if you know if you, this is an iPhone 6 plus um, let me know if it's doing it to you with any other iPhones, uh, 4, 5, 5S, you know, that kind of thing, uh, 7. I'd be curious to see. Uh, that way we can rule out uh, Apple issues and, and just in, and make see if it's a Ford issue. And also let me know what Ford uh, system you're using, if you've got a MySync or MyTouch or any of that stuff. If it works for you, I'd like to know that too uh, and what your setup is and maybe even the make and model year of your car. So we can try to get some sort of consensus on what's going on here. I have found a few other people online uh, on some Ford forums and on Reddit that have similar issues. So uh, I'm not alone. And I've done a master reset. I've done a sync reset. Uh, I've done just about everything you can think to do. I've walked through that with Ford and it, it just doesn't work. Unpairing the phone, repairing the phone, deleting the phone, you know, uh, resetting it then. You know, every, every possible combination doesn't work. Um, so you know it's it's really a bummer because I, I I really liked being able to talk use Siri uh, to do all the various things I like to do. Um, so thanks for watching and yeah, leave some comments and suggestions down below if you have any.